Good afternoon, and thank you for the opportunity to testify. Uh, my name is Pastor Kate Harmon Siberini. I am a priest of the Episcopal Church of New Hampshire, serving congregations in Concord and Franklin. And I come before you today to ask you to protect the vulnerable children of our state by voting in expedience to legislate on House Bill 619. I have heard today from proponents of this bill that what they are most interested in is protecting the children of this state but they have let their own agenda prevent them from seeing the facts. The medical consensus is that children and youth are not at risk from their transgender classmates. It is transgender students themselves who are at significant risk of violence and death. A US and Canadian study published just last year in the Journal of Interpersonal Violence showed that 56% of trans youth reported a previous suicide attempt and 86% reported suicidal thoughts. If we are truly interested, if we are truly interested in protecting our children, then this bill goes about it all wrong. Because the study showed what other studies have affirmed in the past, that what reduces trans sui student suicide rates was having a supportive and affirming school environment, a supportive and affirming family, supporting and affirming medical care, and people in their lives who affirmed them as the people that they know themselves to be. The sponsors of this bill have refused to see the facts, but they have also refused to see the truth. Because transgender children, as we have heard today, are not just statistics. I have been on the phone at 1 a.m. talking to a youth whose family has rejected them for being trans, whose school is not a safe place for them, their family has made having a place to live be contingent on that child against their will going into conversion therapy. And I have stayed on the phone with them through the night, begging them not to end their life, promising them that the world is better with them here, that the world is changing, that things are hard, so hard right now, but one day it will be safe for them. HB 619 makes it harder to keep that promise. Matthew 7, 16 says, we will know the truth of things by their fruits. Many of the proponents of this bill have cited their Christian faith, but there is nothing of God in a bill that would rather transgender children be dead than be themselves. Trans kids are our kids. They are God's kids. They are New Hampshire's kids, and they need our help. Please vote ITL on HB 619. Thank you. Thank you. Are there any questions from the committee?